Rock FM 96.5. Entertainment Kiss on Live on Drive. All right, so if you're craving for some new music that has Slap D in it, well, there's a song out by Ray Doe that features Slap D and a person called COG. It's called Your Back. And uh, you can actually find links on Ray Doe's page. Also, you can find the links on Slap D's page as well. So, uh, you know, it's always cool when these guys come together to make music, you know. Um, even if, even when it's just <laughs> uh, Ray Doe just ad-libbing on a Slap D song. Like, it's just, it's just great. I like it when these guys do music together. Because they go way back, you know, before... Uh, you know, just I think after Slap D sort of like blew up, you know, they, they were making great music together. So this is something exciting. Entertainment Kiss on Live on Drive. Shout out to Chef 187. He is in Australia uh, out there for a few performances. Uh, just go out there and uh, represent Zambia pretty well. You know, there's um, quite a lot of Zambians in Australia. <laughs> So it would be nice to, I'm pretty sure it's great for them, you know, because Sheffy, I've been saying this, is like the biggest Zambian rapper right now. So them getting a treat from, from him and also just the locals over there, like the Australians getting to getting exposed to the hip hop culture, the Zambian hip hop culture is really good. So I trust Chef, Chef 187 will put up a great show. I've seen him perform quite a few times and every time he does it, he puts on a great show. So, hey, I'm, I'm jealous. <laughs> I wish I was in Australia as well. <laughs> Entertainment Kiss on Live on Drive. The boy Miggy Breezy has a video that he's dropping tomorrow called Story. Now, if you don't know who Miggy Breezy is, there was a time when there was this viral video that was going around with a guy screaming boxes and bambers. Bambers. Yes. <laughs> bambers. <laughs> and uh, yeah, he dropped the song of the same name and uh, it blew up quite a bit and after that he's been putting out great music and he's let me say the the, the boxes and bamba song wasn't that great for me i mean i like the hook and some of the lyrics and stuff but you could tell it was very raw and it was just basically taking advantage of the wave that the boxes and bambas was had at the time but then you know as time goes by i can see like he's getting better with his lyrics for me i'm all about the lyrics you know like uh, if you're a rapper, if you say you're rapping, because rap is rhythm and poetry, you know, you, you could have the rhythm, but if the poetry is not there, bro, like, <laughs> you're not getting a, a thumbs up from me. But, you know, he's getting better with time. And I should say I'm looking forward to this video because the Boxes and Bambas video is pretty good. And, you know, he continues to put out great material. And I could see the growth. And all I can hope for is for things to get better from here. You know, sometimes you know, the thing with taking advantage of a trend is because it's a trend. It's going to come and go away, you know, and and people are fickle. <laughs> They'll like ride with the wave. And once that wave is gone, they might not care about you anymore. But when you keep on putting on putting up good music, you know, people will gravitate to it. Yeah. So shout out to Miggy Breezy. Entertainment Kiss on Live on Drive. Now, FJ has put out a a remix of Kiss Kiss Daniel's Sofa. I've said this time and time again. I do not like the name Kiss Daniel. I don't know why anyone in their right mind would choose that as a name for themselves. But that's besides the point. Uh, FJ has done a remix to this. He's calling it the Fumbani Remix. I think you would know by now that Fumbani is FJ's real name. And when he's producing, he uses that name. So uh, he's he's put a few vocals on it. And the reception seems pretty okay, you know. I hope this I hope Kiss Daniel listens to this song and maybe they could actually collaborate on an actual song together, you know. That'd be cool. Entertainment Kiss on Live on Drive. I saw a post that uh, came through from Double HP. That's Hip Hop Pansula. Uh, he's in a song called Superman that is by Casper Your Vest. And um, the, the, the funny thing is, before I saw that post, Casper Your Vest today was talking about how he really wanted the song Superman to get on radio. I heard the song Superman and it's not... It's not his usual turn-up song, you know, the turn-up tracks like 
Ditombo and and all of that. Like this is just like sort of like a conscious, semi-conscious record. And he's saying South African radio is not picking up quick enough. They're not taking it on. But well, he's really trying to push it onto radio. And I guess him shooting a video t- for it could actually help with that. You know, uh, sometimes the visuals make you like the song better, and then creates. It sort of creates a, a bigger demand for the song. I remember sort of like the way w- what happened with uh, Yemi Alade's song. Um, I forget the song here. But it was um, a dance song. You know, she, 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 almost all her music is dance. But yeah, like she had a record out that didn't blow up for a long time. Uh, but then after she did the video, everyone just like started vibing to the record. I just can't remember what the song is. Man, but yeah, like it was, and it's just on the, I can even see the visuals in my head, but yeah, like, once she put out the, it was Coffee Anand, yes, the Coffee Anand song, uh, I remember playing that song so, so many times on radio, and, and yeah, like, after a while, it, it was sort of catching on, but after the video dropped, that's when everyone started vibing to it, so I hope that's what happens with Casper Nyovest's song. And sidebar, happy birthday to Ice Cube. He turns 48 today.